Now, Narendra Modi has sought a relook at the entire ambit of Article 370 in Jammu and Kashmir. While Modi talked about the need for a debate, his party tried to downplay the issue with party president Rajnath Singh saying the BJP was prepared to accept Article 370 if it had proved to be beneficial. Omar Abdullah challenged Modi and other BJP leaders to reproduce verbatim a section of Article 370 on the state law, while the Congress called it doublespeak. Zafar Iqbal reports. <laughs> यहां के सामान्य मानवी का भला हुआ है या नहीं हुआ है इसकी चर्चा तो कम से कम करो चर्चा तक करने को तैयार नहीं मैं चाहता हूं देश के संविधान के जानकार लोग इस पर चर्चा करें यदि धारा 370 से जम्मू कश्मीर का कोई लाभ है यहां की गरीबी दूर हुई है बेरोजगारी दूर हुई है यदि यहां का विकास हुआ है a departure from the BJP's position that seeks complete abrogation of the special status to Jammu and Kashmir. But in his first public rally in the state as the BJP's prime ministerial candidate, Narendra Modi also went on to argue that people from the state, instead of getting special status, were actually deprived. Yes, separate, separate, ke naam par. separatism ko badhawa diya gaya hai na bule. हिंदुस्तान के उस समय के प्रधानमंत्री पंडित नेहरू जी ने कहा था धारा 370 को लेकर के उन्होंने कहा था ये धारा समय रहते गिसते गिसते गिस जाएगी ऐसा कहा था प्रधानमंत्री जी क्या आपकी सरकार पंडित नेहरू जी ने जो कहा था वो करने के लिए तैयार है in a strong response, Omar Abdullah hit back on Twitter. He said, Modi very conveniently used me and my sister as examples to illustrate a point that has no bearing in truth. Either he lies or is ill-informed. Women do not lose their domicile right by marrying non-state subjects regardless of the propaganda surrounding the issue. And no, Mr. Modi, tourism isn't suffering and our tourists are not going to Himachal Pradesh. It's the reverse now, but why should the facts bother you? He tweeted. It was one of the biggest rallies in Jammu in the recent past. Narendra Modi touched upon several issues, prominently Article 370. But whether this massive gathering will actually transform into votes at the end of the day for the BJP, that's the big question. In Jammu, with Darshan Kumar Zafar Iqbal for NDTV. And Union Minister Manish Tiwari said Modi's statements shows the ignorance of the BJP. Let's esteem the Prime Ministerial nominee. The manner in which they speak about Article 370 and Article 371 makes me conclude that they've neither read the Constitution of India or nor have they cared to pay attention to detail. Article 370 and 371 are provisions which integrate various regions of India into the national mainstream. That it uh, completely reveals their double speak. Ten years ago, five years ago, one year ago, you would hear the BJP talking about abrogating Article 370. Now they are talking about a debate on Article 370.